All data storage is electronically locked. The key chip with the correct data is saved. It must be set. Let's do it then. E card R. Letter R is carved into the card. We have L, R. Memo is in data storage. Dear Paul, I finally found the clue. This is the key card that you need to enter his secret lab. The only chance to enter it is during tonight's experiment. Paying the other key card without hesitation. The other key card is in the chief's room. I heard the secret codes for the hidden safe are written on the panel keys. If we find out where the laboratory is, everything will be solved. Leave that to you. Hmm. So we need two. I mean, we have the two cards. Category of the data stored shown here. The weapons development project in this facility. All right. I guess that's all we need from down here. What does this say? Third energy fundamental theory. The chemical reaction experiment data for the stabilizer. Real question is where do we set these key cards? Clearly one is like left and right. Presumably. Fuck you guys. Maybe we should have gone back and saved. Eh. Honestly, it would be just a pretty big risk. For what it's worth. With the card you have now, you can go up to the first floor. Let's do it. So we're probably going to need to rewrite our card again eventually. What is this in the middle here? Nothing in particular. The map of the first and second floors is shown on the panel. There's no way this guy's secret lab just appears on the map somewhere, right? Oh, we can see behind that, there's that locked door. There's one more room there. That must be something we have to go through a vent to get through or something. Hmm. Where does this spit me out again? That hallway there. Oh, can we push this, perhaps? This is the same object. Huzzah. We fucking did it. Bit of recovery aid there. It's a shame we couldn't open that red box. Well, there's another one right here. Wow. Two plugs to open it. We probably should do this, huh? I mean, this isn't a terribly inconvenient spot. Holy shit. Poison darts. Kills an enemy in a single shot. Shotgun bullets. Damn, we're fucking rolling in it now. At least that other box is pretty close if we do want to end up going back. Intensifier. Let me see what this intensifier is all about. Hmm. Let's hold off on that. 
Damn. Well, we at least we can use our handgun now. Let's put this away. Put that away. Our hemostat. Probably could mix the hemostat with these med packs, honestly. Let's do that. So that's med pack M plus. Mm. You know, I thought that was going to make it into a med pack that also stopped bleeding, but it doesn't. So that's a bit sad. Kahima stat with us. One poison dart. 12 shotgun bullets, or 10 shotgun bullets. I mean, that's probably fine. We can, we can do more mixing if we need to. What do we have currently in our shotgun? We got the one dart. It should free up a slot for us once we use it. Yeah, let's hop through here. For sure, save after that. We gotta think about where... Where we can use these cards. I don't trust not taking damage from that guy, so we're gonna go up and around. It's a little bit annoying, but... I think it's a bit safer. Pop into the save room here. There's no way that elevator leads to uh, the lab, right? I'm trying to think of any spots that had like key card type stuff. Can't think of any right now. Let's pop in here really quick, see what's up. See if there's been any new info. Probably not. What? Oh, I don't see any signs of Doc here. No. Nothing new. Check this really quick. Okay, so this does require an ID card. It's just we need different info. There's no way Paul's ID card has the proper info, right? Wouldn't imagine that to be the case. Look at our map really quick. See if there's anything I might have missed here. So it's a hidden laboratory somewhere. B1. Well, we never fucked with that thing that we took the screws off of. No way we had to mess with that, right? Fuck. Am I really going to run all the way back there? Hmm. I'm regretting not examining that again before we left. That feels so bad. I mean, we could get Paul's ID, but I don't think that matters. We do have his fingerprints. We might as well just get it right away. All right, let's give it a shot. It's right over here. Let's just see what happens. The other thing I'm curious about, this doesn't remove this from our inventory, right? No. I think that's still in here. Yeah, even the dart is as well. Pop in here, adjust the ID, we'll go back into the elevator. Dodge past all the guys, and if it does nothing, we can always reload the save. It's not a terribly big deal. 
All right, this guy being back in here is a little, a little annoying. What was the number? Five eight one zero four. Holy fuck! Please. Jesus Christ, man. Oh my God. He's ripping on my fucking leg. I don't think we need to do this. We're probably going to end up reloading. Just kidding. We definitely don't need to do that anymore. Okay, that's okay. What happens down at the bottom of this is probably going to be nothing as well. I was just very curious if we needed to rewrite. There's probably actually another. I mean, we do have the fingerprint thing. You'd think it would remove it from our inventory if we really don't need it. If there was anything we missed back there. I know we picked something up back there, but I saw like one of the background details looked like it might have been something we could interact with. What about this elevator? Brianna. How you doing, girl? How was your little uh, hangout with Stephanie? Oh my god. I can't wait to see. Man, it'll be really convenient once that shutter's opened up. Coming. Nice. Can't wait to see. Uh, this is a little bit awkward. Let's go this way. That's good. That makes me happy. I watch this be absolutely nothing. I don't have to operate this right now. All right, I fucking knew it. So we will have to come down here again eventually, but not right now. Real question is, where's the lab then? <laughs> yeah, I can't think of a, a spot with a, a key card. Or anything like that. Thankfully, this game isn't too hard. We have a lot of healing items. I think it would take a lot for us to really be in trouble. We're going to try and see if we can find any hints about where this lab is. God, that's so bright. What did Stephanie draw? We get the latest save here. Facility first floor. Yes, beautiful. So, there's that lecture room. And there's gotta be something I'm missing. There's the bathroom. So that door on the second floor, that's just locked from the other side. That's not a key card. Polywirl with a realistic feet. That sounds fucking disturbing. 
Now that door, I don't know if we ever checked what that was. How do I get there? Facility outdoors. I don't know if we've ever actually been to that side. That is indeed cursed. It's beyond cursed. How do we get there? Facility outdoors. Because none of those rooms connect to that spot up there. I do love me some Poliwhirl though. Poliwhirl is like a definitive Pokemon. Like when you look at Poliwhirl, you're like, yeah, that's that's what a Pokemon is basically. <laughs> So if we come in through the facility, it must have something to do with that elevator that doesn't work, but there's no key card slots there either. I don't know why that door is not blocked off. Agreed. Little mans. All right, we're going to kind of fuck around a little bit and just see, see what's what here. I don't think this is going to lead us to anything, but we can at least take a look. What was that head turn? Is this something we can examine? As we ran by, she like looked over at something. I thought maybe it was an interactable. Man, I can't believe they made two of these games and just never again. Because this is really fucking good. I'll join the legion of people that are like... Just in so much pain because this series has been ignored. Because this is pretty fucking rad, I gotta say. Now, last time we came through, there was a dinosaur in here, so we have to be a little careful. Uh, I mean, we have health. I think I'd rather just eat the hit and, and spend the health pack. In fact, we have two resuscitations on us, even. I like how she's still limping in the, the door open animation. Bleeding right now? No. But maybe. So up there's the crane. This is an emergency hatch that we can't use. I want to check this elevator again. I don't think this is going to be fruitful. But I've got to just check it out. And we got the info from the library, but that just seems like a dead end. It did mention the chief's room. You get the other card, but I'm wondering if maybe it's somewhere near the chief's room. I don't know. It's tough. They even illuminate this door. Like, look at this. Yeah, so the elevator just isn't responding. It's not like it's locked or anything. Very, just very weird that it's not a red, a red door on the map. All right, let's go back this way. This is probably going to get me killed. Not a huge deal though. I'm just looking for info at this point. The fuck? The crack looks very deep. It's too dangerous to jump over it. When the fuck did the earth break away here? We initially ran through this area, but I guess the ground, the cliffside collapsed or something. I don't know. Well, that was a whole lot of nothing. Yeah, I guess we'll just reload again. I'm not sure. Make sure to lock the door 
to the heliport hangar when using the big elevator. Let's look at what is at the end of this, because I don't remember what this room looks like. I think it's just like a generator, though. Okay, we're planning on reloading our save anyway. Yeah, that's the map. I might have to get a little bit of a hint before we uh, play this again, just so I'm not totally lost. I'll have to look and see. There is a site that offers good hints that doesn't tell you doesn't tell you exactly what to do. I'll have to see if this game is on there. Yeah, this is just the pipe area. Damn, even her uh, ladder climbing animation is more labored when you're uh, low on health. Yeah, this area is whole lot of nothing for the most part. Turn the power on. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll we'll just reload and we'll come back to this. Oh, geez, excuse me. With a little bit of a hint on where we're supposed to go next. I don't want to look up the answer too much, but I feel like I've combed this map pretty hard just looking for that that one corpse. I don't remember anything outside that we can put these two cards into. I don't know. Let's look at the description on them again. We're giving it an honest try here. Letter L is carved into the card. A key card that can unlock an electronic lock. Oh shit, we didn't do this. Let's go do that, actually. We got bit, so I'm gonna reload. I was ready to call it, but uh, I think we can unlock those boxes in the medical bay. Check it out real quick. Who knows, maybe there'll be like a memo in there. It's probably just like an item. That would be really stinky if that guy gave us a key and then you had to examine his corpse again to get a key that gates progression. If you miss that key, you'd be pretty sad. All right, let's see what happens. I forgot about that little key. I've got a, a decent amount of confidence that that will open what I think it will. We'll see. We'll see here. Yeah, right down the stairs should be where we want to be. There is a box that we're passing by as well, so we can even free up a little inventory space if we need to. Yeah, we got two slots. You'll put one thing away. Just put these bullets in here really quick. Well, mm, I want the bullets on me. We're going to start killing some guys eventually. 19 shotgun rounds. We've done pretty well to run past guys, but we had such a, a drought of ammo. I mean, it's not like we're too far off from the box if we end up getting too many items. All right, let's see. Oh, nice. This is what we want. You've unlocked the emergency case. Resuscitation. That's nice, I guess, but it's not anything that's going to help us beat the game. Oh, that key was a one-time use? Kind of curious what's in the other side now. I'm sure there's another one of those keys in the game. All right, we're just resetting the game over and over. 
It it might even be the same item. Who knows? But I'm very curious. It's probably just like a med pack. Let's see, though. I was right in thinking that it's just a consumable. The only issue is that it's going to... The curiosity is going to kill me. If we can't find out what it is. Because you know I'm going to go through the whole game and not find the other key. Let's see what it is. Man, I wonder how much better the second game is. Because I think people generally like the second one better. And I'm liking this a lot, so I'm pretty excited. I might not play it again, like play it immediately after this. Just give us a little little time to breathe between games. But I'm definitely going to play it sometime soon. I've got so many PS1 games on my PS3. <laughs> I honestly think my PS3 is my most used console this year. I've played so much on PS3. I liked the PS3 before, but I feel like I've fallen in love with it all over again. All right, let's see. Watch it be nothing extraordinary. The multiplier. Mixing this with another medicine will allow you to multiply that item. I mean, that's nice. Gets us more of the same item. Very weird that they did the menus so different from Resident Evil. We can mix this with anything, I guess. I guess not necessarily anything, but... Get another med pack M. More effective med pack M. Eh, whatever. That's fine, I guess. Well, at least we remembered to do that, so we will save.